Awesome. If we can start, do uh, you guys expect this kind of weather to train in? Yeah, of course, yeah. yeah. Um, you can, when you think of Africa, you think of the heat and the sun. And uh, we felt it today when we were out there running, so now yeah, we expected it. But it's going to change a bit for the game? The weather? Yeah. I don't know, you, yeah. <laughs> you tell me. <laughs> we'll cool it down a bit for you for Saturday. That sounds good. <laughs> Looking forward to the game, uh, your feelings and, and how's the team's preparation going? Yeah, of course. Um, you know, it's always an exciting challenge, mostly against um, South Africans and you know, um, the boys are getting amped up for it as we build throughout our week. And, you know, each day as it comes, you know, get closer and closer to the game and the excitements start reaching us. So, uh, yeah, we're excited for it. We, we know the challenge that's coming, so yeah. Mark, is this your first time playing in South Africa? Uh, nah. No, nah, it's not. not yet? Yeah. Yeah, I've played here before. At Dennis Park? Alice Park, and uh, we played in Pretoria and Cape Town. And was here. Blues. Yeah. Yep. What, what, what have those lessons sort of taught you as you head into to playing Test Rugby over here? Um, it's real, I guess it gets real hard on the lungs real quick. Um, I guess that altitude kind of kicks in real fast and uh, every game is like a Test match, even when we're playing when we're here Super, so it'll be the same now. and. I think it'll be a more physical challenge, knowing that they're up for the challenge and we're here on their home soil, so it'll be a good challenge. Yeah. You've had a pretty rapid rise over the last couple of years, but your first test playing here. What have your teammates told you about you know, playing the Springboks in South Africa and that sort of challenge? Um, I guess it's, you know, it's different. Each, each country has their own different um, cultures and stuff like that. And they're just saying, like, just embrace it, you know. Um, I'm a South African, oh, like, oh, half South African, so I haven't really seen what it's like. So coming back here, it's always me, you know, just to see the culture. And yeah, it's just embracing as I go through, so yeah. Is that connection important to you, the South African connection? Yeah, I guess anyone, yeah, any, any culture is um, important to any person. So I guess for myself, I'm, you know, trying to find that out and on my journey as well, so yeah. On, on Saturday, is it important, given where the Springboks are, where the All Blacks are, is it important that you start fast or just be cautious and, and stick to your systems? We'll see what happens on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, I mean, there's a lot of history, Springboks, All Blacks at Ellis Park. Um, what, what do you sort of remember most about watching games between the Springboks and All Blacks at Ellis Park? Uh, yeah, like I said in the beginning, um, massive, um, you know, respect for both sides, and you know they're both, you know, we're both competitors. You know, their team, you know, from last year, you know, winning the World Cup and hitting now, they're still showing their dominance, and you know, we're a team that's still, you know, doing our best to find our performances, and stack good performances. So, you know, we'll be looking forward to that Saturday and the previous history is me watching. I guess, yeah. As a Kiwi watching back from home, you, you can see it. You know, you just only support from afar, and you know you. Like, praise the boys, you know, go well, and you can see it's a tough battle every time they come, you know, any game, wherever it is in South Africa. So, yeah, we'll be excited. Yeah. You guys carry any pain from the World Cup last year final? Any any pain? Pain? No, no, yeah, do you, do you still carry that with you guys? <laughs> oh, man, it's long gone now. Mark, 13 players uh, have never played rugby in South Africa before, mm -hmm. with the franchise or international. Does that create any sort of mystique for the lads? No, I guess, like I said, you know, um, got a lot of experience in our team, you know, a lot of older boys as well, and they pass that down. And I guess that's like, um, you know, you want your young boys to come through, you know, enjoy their journey, embrace the, like the cultures and the experience as they're going through, you know, even our coaches as well, you know. So we're all on this journey together, and as a team, you know, we're taking the, you know, trying to stack good performances and head in the right direction. So, yeah, that's what we're trying to do. You've got a history of playing well against the Springboks. Um, is that something you take through to the game, or do you just go oh, Saturday's another game? Uh, Saturday's another game. Yeah. And uh, tell me, how have you guys um, sort of looked at these two matches? You know, usually sometimes you play one match, you move on. Um, how do you sort of um, how have you sort of put them as 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 as, as, as a grouping mm -hmm. in terms of what you're trying to do? No, I guess um, no. We play that first game against them, and then the second game will be a bit harder. You know what I mean? Because you know, they've had a feel of you know what the players are like and what the team brings. So you know, playing a team back to back is not always easy. It's always going to be a harder challenge the second game. But that first header is going to be exciting. So all of you guys, bring your cameras, come down and watch and enjoy it. <laughs> I recommend it. <laughs>
Actually, you guys have got a very good record at Ellis Park for the last 10 years or so. Sorry, I can't hear what you said. I said, you guys have got a very good record at Ellis Park for the last 10 years or so. I don't think you've lost uh, in 10 years at Ellis Park. Does that uh, give you extra bit of confidence going into the match? And also, what is it about Ellis Park that the, the All Blacks do so well at? I wouldn't personally know. Um, I haven't played there. It'll be my first time. Um, credit to the boys and you know, the history and the jersey that have um, played before me. Um, like I said, you know, we're just going to take it day by day, come to Saturday, you know, we're going to take the beliefs and understandings of our trainings into the Saturday and get ready for that match. And um, it'll be exciting for me. I've never played in Ellis Park, so I'm looking forward to it. Does it have an aura for, for you to go to Ellis Park? An no, aura? An aura? Never been there? Aura. <laughs> aura? <laughs> <laughs> nah, for me, um, I'm, I'm excited just to be here, to be honest. And um, I know a lot of other boys that, you know, Ever since um, the South Africans dropped out of Super, we haven't been able to travel up um, these ways. So just for us to come here, it's massive, you know, just to travel around these ways. So a lot of us are just keen to get into that footy and just play. Yeah. Right, That's Cheers, guys. Yeah. Thank you.